What's up guys, Aeon Basun is here to bring a brand new video to the channel and today we're going to be watching a video called The Correct Way to Say This Word. Now, <sighs> this video bothers me slightly um, and you're going to see why. So let's jump right into the video. Okay guys, we need to talk about this word right here. I have gotten several comments telling me that I pronounce this word wrong. I know in the grand scheme of things, this doesn't really matter. It's actually pretty insignificant, but I thought that it would be a fun little topic to talk about with you guys. I do agree. This is not a big topic to talk about, but I'm running out of video ideas, so we're here. The way that I say this word is ukulele, which I know that's how a lot of you guys say it, and everyone I'm surrounded by says it that way. However, in case you don't know the correct, and I'll explain later why I put correct in quotations, but the correct traditional Hawaiian way to say it is ukulele. This is because ukulele is a Hawaiian word that means leaping flea. Uku means flea, and then lele means to jump or to leap. And I think the reason that they call it that is because whenever the fingers move on the frets, they thought it looked like fleas were jumping around or something. I don't even know. I'm not Hawaiian. I know. <laughs> and so I guess whenever all the English speaking people got a hold of this instrument, they started calling it a ukulele. And right there is the problem to it because when English speaking people, AKA white people came to Hawaii, they saw that word and they pronounced it differently. It's almost like they didn't pronounce it right. Hmm. This isn't that uncommon because English is just a combination of a whole bunch of other different languages. And we're constantly adding new words, we change some stuff. So I would not go to say that ukulele is the wrong way to say it, it's just another pronunciation. Okay. It's another pronunciation. I wouldn't exactly go as far to say that it's not wrong, but let's let's keep watching. I also checked a whole bunch of dictionaries, the Merriam and Webster dictionary, dictionary.com, Oxford, Collins, Cambridge, and every single one of them acknowledged ukulele is a correct way to pronounce it. Problem number two! You're one of your ways of backing up yourself on the correct pronunciation is that an English dictionary said that that is a correct way to say it. It's a Hawaiian word. It should not be up to English people to determine how a Hawaiian word is pronounced. That's almost like an English dictionary telling you how to pronounce this word right here. This is the Japanese word for thank you. There is only one correct way to say this word and that's the Japanese way, arigato. Now there is arigato, which would be said by most English spe speaking people. So is that a correct way? No, that is a way to say it, but that is not the correct way because it's a Japanese word and the only way to say it correctly is the Japanese way. Now, if you think that they're both are right, then what's the point of language? What's the point of even correct language pronunciation. And a few of them went on further to say that ukulele is the Hawaiian pronunciation of it. Once again, it's the Hawaiian pronunciation. It's a Hawaiian word, which means that the only correct way to say it is the Hawaiian pronunciation. Again, I'm not trying to say that, oh, she can't say it how she wants to. I couldn't give two sh if she said it uh, ukulele, lili, lali, luli, I couldn't care. So pretty much my point is, you can say it either way. So if y'all have people telling you that you're wrong to say it the way that I'm saying it, don't listen to them because it's a perfectly acceptable way to say the word. I mean, of course we have to acknowledge that ukulele is the traditional way to say it, but in this day and age, a lot of people pronounce it ukulele and it's not wrong. It's just different from the traditional, but that doesn't mean it's incorrect. And that's this is where my problem is is that my thing is that the way she says is that there's a traditional way and there is the English way as if it ever belonged to the English which is at this point I'm just re-emphasizing what I'm trying to say is that it's a Hawaiian word and it's it's a Hawaiian word if you want to say it like that again okay but you have to know that there is a there is a correct way to say this. I really don't think I could get away with going into Guitar Center and asking where the ukuleles are. If a musician 
just doesn't even know what a ukulele is if you say it like that, then, bro, <laughs> I don't know what you're doing, man. To tell the truth, I used to say it ukulele or ukulele, one or the other. And I, my dad worked in a very touristy area, so I heard a lot of different versions as a kid, and I never really knew which was the right one, you know? Um, but last year, so my friend, she had told me that it just wasn't the correct way to say ukulele because in the Hawaiian language, it, there's nothing that, there's no why. And when I tried to argue against that, I couldn't because in the end, that was right, you know? If the Hawaiian language doesn't permit that kind of vowel usage, then the word can't be said like that because it's a Hawaiian word. I almost forgot to put this in, but I don't want to make it seem like, oh, like whatever she says is wrong. I just disagree with it. So, you know, right or wrong, we'll, we'll never know. But I do think, I do disagree with her and uh, do check her out. I mean, she's another musician, you know, so musician to musician, check her out. She does a lot of stuff on the ukulele. And uh, she, she's got like a million subscribers or something. She's like pretty big time, I think. Uh, but check her out. She's got some good stuff. So anyways, but with that said, thanks for watching, guys. I hope you enjoyed that video. If you did, feel free to leave a like on it. And don't forget to hit that subscribe button down below. And if you have any comments that you want to leave on this whole situation, feel free to leave it down below in the comment section. And uh, thanks for watching, guys. And I'll see you next time. It's one of the activities that I offer here at the Cultural Center. And that's playing this instrument called the ukulele.